when you watch a tour player swing and hit these shots, they're very calm and very under control, and there's a very nice even pace and tempo and rhythm. One of the things a person does is they'll take the hands and they'll try to come down because of the phrase, I gotta hit down to make the ball go up. They'll hit down into the ground. You'll see this big, violent motion with the body, and that's to try to pull the club through impact. To counter that is we're going to try to take the club a little bit more away from the golf ball, okay? Not trying to take it to the outside. We're not trying to take it to the inside so that when we come back into the golf ball, we're gonna just try to retrace the path of the club back on the way down, and then we're gonna release the shaft. So releasing the shaft is when the head passes in front of the handle. We're gonna take the head and we're gonna actually push it and use our hands to push the golf club through the shot. When I do that, I don't close the club face. My club face is still pointed up to the sky. And our ideal situation is when the handle can basically stop during the swing, which is something most people don't realize happen, and allows the hands to generate the speed and transfer the speed to the club head. You think about social media and all the myths, mistruths that are passed around. Golf is the same way, and it's another one that most people think you gotta come down to get the ball to go up. No, 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 no. You listen to what Paul has to yeah. say.